Yo, what up YouTube, it's Rain, no, ma, 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 ma. and we're at Box Park Wembley to have a little look at Crep City London, arguably the biggest trainer event in the UK, so just going to walk around, so very informal, um, loads of stands here, um, all set on one level, I will get down and get into the mix of it in a minute, um, so they had some DJs down there, um, and some people that I just don't know who they are, so I'm going to kind of give you my rundown and my thought on it. So ultimately, it was a nice little event, a nice community event. People came out you get to speak to people that you haven't seen in a while or meet um, kind of chapter sneaker heads or whatever you want to call them. The stands, if I'm honest, it was just a lot of samey stuff. And when I say samey stuff, if you have a look around at the tables, um, it's just a lot of dunks, a lot of Yeezys. Like there wasn't any tables which had like exclusive stuff or not even exclusive stuff, rare stuff, like really rare stuff, like coming to these events for a few years, like almost like five years ago, you would have been able to pick up some steals. Like have a look at this, like there's some good bits here, I'm not even gonna lie. But actually, put those LeBrons there. This was probably one of the better tables um, and there isn't much difference to, I don't know, it just, it just seemed a bit lackluster and a bit boring. Um, and some of the stuff shouldn't even be here like this table is just selling customs which I get it makes sense like a custom table look at that Grand Theft Auto customs anyone want those probably not but AO um, those off-white rebores are just a madness but again it's something different but this was probably again one of the only tables that would cause a lot of excitement because it was something different um, everything else was like just stuff that is either still on the shelf now or stuff that they don't plan to sell Ah, this new balance table was alright, it was quite cool. Ah, look at those undefeated. Um, so I think they happen, every, I think Crep City happens every quarter. Um, but look, it's just a wash with Yeezys and stuff that's still sh sat on the shelves. Like, you're hard pressed to find something which is like niche or exclusive. Like, so that, that, those clocks are on sale or went on sale um, a couple years ago. Who, who the hell's gonna buy those? Um, <laughs> the Travis's. So the Travis Low, the first version, were 1.1, 1 1.1 thousand, which is a bit mad. Some of the prices in here are actually more than StockX, which I thought was crazy as well. Um, I don't know what people are playing at, but the venue in itself is quite nice. Um, I prefer Truman Breweries where it used to be held. But I think it's moved on and there's a lot of stipulations in regards to getting that venue, who knows. But Crep City is, is, is a UK team, so you have to support it. I just wish there was more sellers with more limited product or more exclusive product or rarer product. I think that's what I'm saying. But anyway, it's rain. Signing <laughs> <laughs>